At Wakehurst Public School, we received an email from the Nantien Institute challenging us to implement the three acts of goodness. We accepted the challenge. We realised that we were already fulfilling many of the requirements of the challenge. For example, on Harmony Day at Wakehurst, we celebrate friendship and inclusiveness. We all belong. Our student welfare program promotes caring, kindness and resilience, enabling us to find ways to bounce back from difficult times. Our green team focus is on caring for the environment and learning about sustainability. Our school rules reflect acts of goodness. I'm kind, truthful and fair. I care for myself, others and my school. I always try my best. I keep others and myself safe. We uphold our school values. The three acts of goodness really do reflect the chosen values we teach, model and expect here at Wakehurst Public School. I feel it's so important for everyone, no matter what age, to treat all people with kindness and respect. We wondered how then could we demonstrate that the three acts of goodness were being implemented at our school. We read the activity ideas on the Nantien Institute website and decided to implement one activity for each of the three acts of goodness say good words. All classes played a circle game whereby they rolled a ball of wool to a student sitting in the circle and said something kind to that student. Think good thoughts. We wanted to think of others so we collected over 350 tins of food. These were donated to the Exodus Foundation which feeds the homeless and educates struggling school children. The generosity of Wakehurst families was much appreciated. Do good deeds. Students cut out a hand in green paper. Whenever they were seen to be doing a kind deed, they received a stamp on that paper hand. When they had three stamps on the hand, it was attached to a tree in the library. We welcomed Reverend Yu and Reverend Zilly to Wakehurst. They visited some classrooms where children were keen to chat with them. We thanked them for the books and resources they brought for our school. In class, students discussed the three acts of goodness and created an artwork to show their understanding. Yep. In my class, we linked hands to represent the harmony in our classroom. In our class, we talked about the three acts of goodness. We decided to make an artwork of our own hands to show that we belong together. Year 6 created Helping Hands as we wanted to outline the importance of working together to create a better world. In 56D we created peace doves. This was to represent kindness, love and harmony to promote peace in the world. In our class we drew doves to signify peace and goodness. In my class as part of our social skills program we focus on the idea that kindness is catching. The students provided ideas about what kindness means. Then we created two artworks relating these ideas to the three acts of goodness.
Kindergarten created peace doves that remind us to speak good words, do good deeds and think kind thoughts. In 1P, we created beautiful boutique flowers to promote good manners and acts of kindness. This is the kindness tree. Everybody in the school signed their names on it. It was in the library so we could all see it. We displayed our artwork in the school hall where everyone could see it. We welcomed Reverend Rui and her supporters to Wakehurst Public School. Our school captains were delighted to accept the Three Acts of Goodness banner and the huge cheque that Reverend Rui presented to us. Thank you so much. We were most grateful to the Nantian Institute for the generous gift of money which enabled us to create a beautiful wall of values. School values and rules on a tree on the wall in the playground. The wall is a reminder to all of the standards of respect and kindness that we try to live by. Our school principal is proud of Wakehurst Public School. Here the students try to say good words do good deeds, think good thoughts, and we're proud to be a three acts of goodness school.